Yes, guys, welcome back to the channel. We're here again for another 6 p.m. content drop. We're about to see what EA have got, whether it be objectives or SPC builders. So let's just jump straight into it. Let's get into the objectives, see if they've dropped anything new. It's a Wednesday. Hopefully they've uh, dropped the Silver Stars. Doesn't look promising. Okay. So we're slowly chipping away at the Fafana, Cucurella and Renio. We nearly finished both of them. All three of them, sorry. Silver Beast, nothing new there. Icon swaps we haven't really touched at the minute. That's strange. There's nothing... Why is there nothing new there? Have they not released it? Oh, here we go. League 1 Player 2. Okay, so this is when they brought out that Mole, didn't they? So now they've brought in Bendito, Benedetto. That's good. I like that. That's nice. What's that? 15 wins. Score 30 goals using League One players in managerial masterpiece. So, managerial masterpiece is obviously 77 rating. That's not too bad because at least then that's a grindable player. So, f score a finesse goal using League One players in six separate games. Score outside of the box using League One players in four separate games. Assist 20 goals using League One players. And then score 30 goals using League One players. And then win 15 games. So, if you're good, 15 games in total. If not, you're possibly looking at about 20 games. But at the end of the day, that's not too bad. That Benedetto is not a bad player from the face stats anyway. We'll take a further look at the stats um, after. And they've also dropped a League 1 Silver Stars player as well, Klaus. So we'll take a look at that too, which is a bit strange because they've already got that. What's his name? Sam Samibia or something like that. But either way, three games can get, get eight goals and six assists. This isn't a big drama. And that looks actually like a decent right wing back. So that's not a bad shout, that one, to be fair. Have they released anything else? Nothing in milestones. Because obviously they've just brought that League One player out. What about SPCs? Have we got anything big in SPCs today? Have they brought out you for monkey matchups? What have they got for us today? Come on, EA, where are you? Where are you? Locomotive fourth kit. Not a bad kit, not for me. <laughs> UEFA for marking matchups. Let's have a look at that. Because the game's suffering delay, when you put favourites on, you can't get it straight away, so I have to go back to favourites. UEFA for marking matchups, there we go. Bayern versus Lazio, 79 rated, 80 cam, one Champions League common or rare, three nationalities minimum, five clubs maximum, and one Lazio or Bayern player. And then Bruges, Moch and Gladbach and Man City. One Man City or Bodge and Gladbach player. Six leagues. Three players from one club max. UEFA Champions League rare players two. 80, 80 rated and for 85 cam for a rare mix players and a small prime gold players pack respectively. That's not too bad requirements. I mean, the rare gold, small rare gold for a 79 player rated team isn't exactly fantastic. But, you know, if you've got cheap players to get rid of, then obviously go for it. And that's it pretty much for SPCs. The objectives seem to have appeared late. Maybe I, I loaded in a bit quick, but I'm, I didn't because it was 6 o'clock when we loaded in. So that's a bit of a strange one. But at least they've re re released them in time, I suppose. So we'll surely chip away at them. Is that Tony Croyce as well? Like released yesterday. Again, it's just a fantastic card. Engine, anchor, shadow, whatever you want to put on him. It would just be incredible. Guardian, you know, Powerhouse or whatever like that. It's just an incredible card. Cost might be a bit too high for some people, but at the end of the day, from given what EA have been releasing lately, where they've been giving you 90, 91 rated Ribri for 700k, and you now get a 93 crew for, 90, uh, for 350k, it's not too bad. So, let's go to these job EA for marking matchups. Obviously, we don't want to we try not to get rid of some of our Champions League players because you do need the Champions League players for your icon swaps. So, if you can, try and get rid of the off leagues that you don't think you're going to be using. So, we'll try and do that now for you. Champions League common, off leagues such as Portugal, Denmark, or Turkey. And we'll keep, obviously, the main leagues there. So, we only need one. So we'll go with Turkey for the goalkeeper. No, we'll go Portugal for the goalkeeper. Because we don't use many Portuguese players. So let's just see. 
By the way, sorry, I just had my dinner. Uh, so let's just see what we've got in Portugal. Have we got anything big that we can use? Oh, that's Champions League coming, you idiot. Liam, you idiot. You absolute muppet. So we'll get rid of that Pepe. We'll get rid of that Gabriel. Um, we'll keep Pedrino there. We'll get rid of that... No, we'll keep Everton there. So we'll get rid of the Gonzalo Silva. And also the Pinto and the Lima. So that's that. That's good camp. And then we'll go to the German League. Now that we don't have to get rid of um, Champions Leagues. So we'll go to the German League. What have we got here? Let's get rid of that Javi Martinez for the for the Bundesliga with the buy-in requirement. We'll get rid of Boomgartner. We'll also get rid of Kramerich, Piatic, and Juancelo Paciencia. Possibly ruining his name there. Five clubs max. So we've got two Hoffenheim. It's the it's the Portuguese league, isn't it? That's ruining it. We'll see what we can do. We'll see what we can do. We'll slowly chip away together. Let me know in the comments, guys. What do you what do you think of the um, of the SBCs and the objectives being released lately? Do you think they're any good for you guys? Have you uh, are they taking you too long? I was speaking to some people um, today in the chat, uh, and they, they say that they think for them they think it's too long, um, and I, I couldn't agree. I, I could agree. But then I could also disagree, um, just purely based on the fact of, you know, for the squad foundations players, you needed, I think it was 16, 16 games um, to complete some of them. Where And obviously now you need about 20 odd games, <clears throat> which is, which is kind of, you know, a, a, it is a problem. But from going from the chance that when you get one player, um... Sorry, I'm just in my head trying to figure this out. From one goal player, when you usually got like the Voland and stuff like that, you only played eight games. I don't think it's it is terrible, but I don't think it's amazing either. You know, I, I, there are ups and there are downs to it. So we just kind of have to take it with a pinch of salt and um, go with what we can sort of go with. But yeah, it, it could be better. In my in my eyes, it, it could be worse. You know, it's just one of them. Just one of them. It's that one in it. It's the, we need a we need a big Portugal Porto one. If we go dear Octavo, would that no? It won't even get us the cam. Or the rating. Oh my goodness. The cam's going to still be there, but the rating's not. Because it's these, isn't it? Okay, we'll go. Let's see what we get. See if we can get anything for Benfica. We, we might have to overpay a little bit. Um, no. Oh, nearly. <laughs> Nearly, because sometimes I'm an idiot and my fat thumbs seem to be doing what they want. This one's going to be Grimaldo, isn't it? It's the only one that's there. Yeah. Have they got another right back? Or a right wing back? No, that's the club. What an idiot! Sometimes, sometimes, I swear to God, I don't look at what I'm doing. No, okay. So we might have to over... Porto? Porto got anything? For left back? Alex Tellers. Of course it's Alex Tellers. There's only Alex Tellers. Left mid? Right, so we've got the rating. We just need the cam. 
There. Simple. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. That's good. That's good. Put that there. That's that one done. Motion Glad Back City. 85 Kemp, 80 rated. Um. So again, Champions League rares. I don't know if we've got off leagues or not. Tadic could go. Marlos can go. Where's that Tadic? Tadic can go. Was it minimum f minimum two? So he can go there. Tadic can go there. Marlos can go there. So now we just need to get eight rated <coughs> somehow without breaking the bank. So Fabianski. We got right back. We'll go Kufal. Centre halves. Ruben Diaz for the City player. And then Evans can go too. And we'll throw in a Bertrand there. So we need six leagues minimum, which shouldn't be too difficult. Shouldn't be too difficult. Because now we just start chucking in random players from everywhere else. We'll go League Earn, even though we probably shouldn't do that actually. Bundesliga again. Taliso. Chan and just put Campbell in there. And the chemistry. It's okay, we'll figure it because it's Chad Bundesliga. So if we can get rid of the Bundesliga, I'm just going to chuck him in there. I'm not going to use him. It's not a problem. Right mid. What have we got? Right mid for Bundesliga. Bellarabi can go. Still not, because I'm an idiot. League on. Augustine can go. So I'm figuring it out. I'm figuring it out. Give me a chance, boys. Give me a chance. Got Portugal right back. We just had one, so I might have to pay again for him. Okay. So, Portuguese right back, which obviously we'll get a cheap one. Because I think we've got the rating. We have, perfect. That's Cedric, though. So, Miguel Lopez. So, we've got the rating. We just need to get the chem and obviously the six leagues. So... Now, 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 what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Greek, so we'll go Jose Sa. And then if we can get that as a Portuguese, would that still do it? Will that do it? No. So now, Portuguese left back. That should do it. No. So that's dropped the rating. And the cam. Hmm. Okay. 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 So see if we can do it like this. Jeez, these do want to be expensive, aren't they? I just overpay. I... It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay.
and now it's just the chem. If I get him there, will that be the chem and the rated? No. Nearly. <laughs> Nearly there, boys. Nearly there. It's overplay for Lamar. Right, where are we? There we go. We'll go right, left wing to left, uh, left mid to left wing, and there you go. All done. Simple as that. That's your Champions League done. Perfect. That's them done. I think we'll open, we'll bop open a pack for you, and then I think we'll call it a day on that one. We'll try to get the Silver Stars done in this while we're, while we're live on stream right now. I'll leave links in the description if you want to follow the channel live on Twitch, Instagram and Twitter. Um, and then hopefully when you come back tomorrow for tomorrow's episode, we would have done him. And we can sort of give you review or my review on how I think, how he, how he is and his stats and that. Um, so we'll do that tomorrow. We won't right now. Okay, that was a disappointment. And it's made me change my mind because now I'm going to show you the stats because I think you deserve that actually given the fact that you've stuck around for this long. Um, because that's what the video is about today. It's about the 6pm content drop. So if I didn't show you the stats, I don't think I would have been, I would have been doing you an injustice. Um, so let me just quickly clear these up. We'll leave them there. We'll go look at this new um, Silver Stars quickly. This is the current team that we're using right now to get the Renier and Fafana objective. We're doing pretty well so far and we've nearly done both of them. Um, so we're chipping away at them. Right, where are you, Mr. Sir? Where are you, sir? There you are, Klaus. And he's got a dynamic image already. Nice. Right, pace is decent. Pace is decent. Shooting's decent. Passing's okay for a silver because they boosted his stats. You know, dribbling's not too bad. What is he? Five, he's 6 1. And they're given 91 agility. That's a bit a bit strange, but you give him a shadow, and it might it might come into play a bit more. That's not a bad card, actually. To be fair, if you if you did give him a shadow, but the only thing is, you've already got the Sambia card, and now to be fair, that Sambia card isn't exactly fantastic. So you could use him as a CDM, switching from right back to CDM, or even just start him off as a centre half. Um, which wouldn't be a too bad of a shout, actually. Okay, yeah, that's not a bad card. I, I, we're, we're, obviously, we're going to do it because we're going to chip away at him. Um, so we'll show, we'll talk about him on next episode and how we how he plays in games. We might have a few games with him. <clears throat> pardon me on stream for you guys. So uh, come join along. If you've enjoyed this video, please hit that like button, uh, hit that subscribe button if you want to see more more content like this. Um, and also follow the channel on Twitch, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, whatever you want. And um, we'll see you next time. Stay safe out there, guys.